Stacey Harris was a Canadian-born actor with hundreds of film and television appearances. Harris was best known for his role as Agent Jim Taylor on ABC Radio's This Is Your FBI and, later, for playing varied characters, often villains, on various programs produced by Jack Webb's Mark 7 Limited, such as Dragnet, Noah's Ark, GE True, Adam 12, Emergency, and O'Hara, U.S. Treasury. Harris guest starred in the religion anthology series, Crossroads and played a gangster in the 1956 time travel television episode of the anthology series Conflict entitled Man from 1997, opposite James Garner and Charles Ruggles. Thereafter, he appeared as Whit Lasseter in the 1958 episode The Man Who Waited of the NBC children's western series Buckskin. He guest-starred as Colonel Nicholson in the 1959 episode A Night at Trapper's Landing of the NBC western series Riverboat, starring Darren McGavin. Harris appeared too in three syndicated series, Whirly Birds, starring Kenneth Toby, Sheriff of Cochise and U.S. Marshall, both with John Bromfield, and as the character Ed Miller in the episode Mystery of the Black Stallion of the Western series, Frontier Doctor, starring Rex Allen. He was cast in two episodes of the David Janssen crime drama Richard Diamond, Private Detective. Harris in 1958 portrayed Max Bowen in The Hem Tree, and in 1959 as Abel Crowder in Rough Track to Payday, episodes of the CBS Western series. The Texan, starring Rory Calhoun. In 1960, Harris was cast as a drummer named Kramer in the episode Fair Game of the ABC Western series The Rebel, starring Nick Adams. Harris appeared in three episodes of CBS's Perry Mason, playing the role of murder victim Frank Curran in The Case of the Married Moonlighter. Perry's client Frank Brooks in The Case of the Lost Last Act and murderer Frank Brigham in The Case of the Crying Comedian in 1961. In 1969, Harris played the corrupt and cowardly Mayor Ackerson of the since ghost town of Helena, Texas. In the episode, the oldest law of the syndicated television series, Death Valley Days, hosted by Robert Taylor not long before Taylor's own death. Popular character actor Jim Davis played Colonel William G. Butler, who takes revenge on the town after its citizens refused to disclose the killer of Butler's son, Emmett, who died from a stray bullet from a saloon brawl. Butler arranges for the San Antonio and Aransas Pass Railway to bypass Helena, instead Carnes City, south of San Antonio, becomes the seat of government of Carnes County. Tom Lowell played Emmett Butler, and Tyler McVeigh was cast as Parson Blake in this episode. Harris died in 1973 at the age of 54 in Los Angeles, California of an apparent heart attack.